Pontiac DGG, man, how you doing? What's good? What's good? And one of the one of the one of the biggest YouTubers in the game, man, with what? We can we could really say a can we say a billion views? Yeah, I'm not a YouTuber no more though. I quit that. I'm a rapper. Okay, so full time rapper. Yeah. Okay. I so, used to be a YouTuber. It, it, That's my old life and shit. Yeah. Are you trying to like erase your legacy as a YouTuber or Nah, I'm just I'm just a rapper. Yeah. Right, right, right. You're a musician, but still the all the views that you put together. You can't. You you still got to add that to your to your legacy too, man. A billion views. No, nah, I feel that. No, that's that's incredible. You know, I always had love for it, but you know, right. I'm a, I'm a full time rapper now. That's what's up. I'm an artist. So yeah. So you're you're from um, Pontiac, right? That's in Michigan. Yeah. Okay, and I know you've done a lot of interviews, so I don't want to be repetitive, but um, what? Okay, moving out of Michigan, like what led to that? You know, you graduated school, right? Mm-hmm. And then what was next? Um, I graduated high school. I went to college, and then that's when I really started doing YouTube. And then I got in this relationship with this girl, and we started filming together. We whoop all that. And went, and then the summer going into sophomore year of college, I got like a viral video, it was like a prank or something. And then I just started seeing crazy money. And then after that, I moved out, dropped out of college, moved to LA. And yeah, the rest is history. When when you said um, you dropped out of college, how much money do you think you had when you dropped out of college? I dropped out of college. I had like forty thousand in the bank, hmm. but I had more money coming. I had like like twenty coming. So I knew I was straight, you know what I'm saying? So I had like probably like sixty thousand dollars. What do your parents say when you're like, you know, at the time you were a YouTuber, you were making money. What are your parents saying when you, you know, you got forty thousand in your account, you got more coming in? What did your mom and dad say about you know, you dropping out? Nah, they supported it. Cause I was getting money, bro. Like I was paying the bills. I was paying my mom rent. Like I was getting money, bro. I was I was lit, you know, it was, you couldn't tell me nothing, you know what I'm saying? So it was like, it was about time that I dropped out of college. It didn't make sense at some point. It's like, why am I going to this class? And I, if I graduate, I'm going to make how much money? You know what I mean? And I just make right. that in the month. You know what I'm saying? It just didn't make sense. So at that time, when you're going viral, you become the, the breadwinner in, in your immediate family, correct? Yeah. Okay, so you helping your mom pay bills and things of that nature? Mm-hmm. All that, man. And all this sparks from a viral video. Like, what's your, what's going through your head when you're going viral? Nothing, really. It's just, you don't feel like nothing. You know what I mean? It's mm-hmm. just like, it's just like digital. That's why I like music, because if you get a viral song, you going to feel it when you go perform. You know what I'm saying? Right. Versus like with YouTube, it's just like, it's just, it's just numbers, you know? Right. Facts. Facts. So you drop out of college and do you move to LA right away? Yeah. Yep. Okay. So you move out there with your girlfriend and then things mm-hmm. just go up from there. Yeah. Yeah. We broke up though. She gone. You're in LA. You know you're you're famous for the for the BMW i8, right? Oh yeah, yeah. I got that. I got that dream when I was nineteen. I had. I'm gonna tell you a secret. I ain't never told nobody this. I think I have, but I I had like I think I had another sixty in the bank. It was just sixty, and I put twenty thousand dollars down for that car. Mm. You know. You you kind of made that car because you know a lot of young people don't really know cars like that. Yeah. But when you bought that car, that that was like you that car. When people saw that car, that was that's the DG that's DGG's car. You know what I mean? Yeah, I love he got lit, huh? Yeah, that shit was that shit was lit. So you bought that car when you had sixty grand in the bank. Yeah, but I paid twenty thousand down. 
But the reason I did it, the reason I did it is because I knew, like, I just know I'm finna make a lot of money. You know what I mean? So it's like, like, I'm in a position right now in life where I can literally choose how much money I want to make. It's literally up to me. You know what I mean? Right. So it just make me. That's just, a blessing. Yeah, it's really, it really is. You know, but it's just off my hard work. Yeah. Did you did you sell the I? Uh, nah. Uh, you I did. I, I traded it for the roaster joint. Okay. Yeah. Do you miss it? Nah. I mean, I'm really I'm off the I H now. I ain't gonna lie. I don't even drive my shit no more. To be honest. 